So this is fine, okay, it's fine. <laughs> Y'all, I'm not even acting. This is just like how I'm feeling right now. It's been a tough day. Just like stressed about things I shouldn't stress about. And I got something in the mail today and I was like, eh, like I'll just push it. Okay. So my battery ran out and I had to just change it. So it cut me off. But anyways, uh, what was I saying? Yeah, I got something in the mail from Amazon and I was like, I'm gonna just put it off and do it tomorrow. But then... I was like, you know what? I'm just gonna do it because I feel like creating and filming today. And this is a decision I made right before I was about to wash my face. That's why I have, oh my God. That is why I have my little headband on right now because I was trying to move my hair away from my face so I can wash my face, you know? If y'all didn't know, or if you couldn't tell from my other videos, I bleached my hair twice during this quarantine season. Today, I finally received, hold up, this in the mail. This is Smoky Silver, if, if you can see right there. Smoky Silver Hair Dye. Oh, it says exclusively for light blondes. I'm not a light blonde. Does that mean I don't, it won't work on me? I'm getting kind of scared now because I just read here on the side of the box that it's not recommended for dark blonde hair or darker um you know what carpe diem live in <laughs> live in the moment it's gotta do it i bought this so i'm gonna try it i used l'oreal's ombre kit twice and so this is the the results from that i will list everything in my bio from amazon i've just been obsessed with making like because i have an amazon page so i've just been obsessed making lists and adding different items i've been obsessed with on it and so if you're interested uh go check it out and see what i've been liking these days it's very therapeutic it's almost like blogging okay so it comes with this the conditioner or what you might call it and then it comes with the color gel that i'm supposed to put in the other container i also have this i do not know what this is and then this is shimmer conditioner here are the instructions i love that it comes with two gloves so that i don't bleach my hair or i mean so that i don't bleach my hand so this is what it's supposed to look like so if you have super light if you have super light hair it's supposed to turn into this silver color and then medium color and then the dark i just feel like my hair might turn dark brown because this looks like a pretty dark silver so maybe it'll turn into a brown color with some silver hints or maybe like an ugly gray it's a risk i'm willing to take Okay, so I just changed into a shirt with my name on it because I thought if I wore a black or darker shirt, it would stain it. We'll see. Oh my gosh, this is really close. This is my bed. <laughs> I am first going to put the gloves on because I don't want anything to get on my finger. The first thing I'm going to do is snap Snap the tip off for this, cap from the bottom, pour all of this into that. Okay, so this is the first item that I have. It's a, it's the coloring gel. So I'm going to snap that open, being very careful. And then, oh, maybe I should have snapped. Okay, hold up. Maybe I should have snapped this open first. I snapped the tip off, but some of the stuff got on my gloves. So thank goodness I am wearing the gloves. Okay, I am unscrewing the top. And then I'm going to put number one into number two. I highly, oh, right here. I highly do not recommend that you do this on your bed, but I'm doing this so that the background is prettier. Okay, I got everything in number two container. 
So this pretty thing is number three. So I'm going to snap this open. It's not working. Okay, I think my camera is a little broken. But here is the cool looking thing. Here, I'm going to stand right here as the background. So that the camera focuses on this item. Hello. Okay, here it is. Let's squeeze this in. Great, I got everything in. And then I'm gonna shake it up now. I'm very bad at filming and doing things. Okay, I'm gonna shake it. I think it's all mixed. We will start putting it on my hair. Okay, so I have a towel. I'm gonna put it around my shoulders so that we can start this. I'm pretty sure my hair is gonna hate me for this, but what else can you try new things out if you're not staying at home, you know? Here is the bun and then And then my hair, I feel like I am going to get dye all over myself. Okay, I'm scared, but let's do it. Okay, I have my gloves on. The formula here. Do you see how harsh these lines are for when I bleached it? Okay, let's try it. Ooh. Ooh, let me tell you, it does not smell good. <coughs> oh my god, I think I need a mask. Especially because it's literally right in front of my face. Oh no. What do I do, everyone? What do I do? Uh oh. I should have tied my hair for this. Or I should have brushed my hair out. The smell is like really bad. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna put it on my hand and then just like brush it through. I'm really using this camera as my mirror. Which is probably not a good idea. But, oh my god, I should have untangled my hair <laughs> before I started this. <laughs> Did I do a lot? I don't know, let's just go on to the next side. The hair dye is actually turning purple for some reason. Please, if you are trying to do this, <laughs> Ooh, put a mask on because the smell is so bad. How am I doing? I'm using my camera as a mirror and I'm not wearing glasses. I think it's okay. Okay, I'm gonna go to the restroom and finish everything else because I feel like with this tiny camera, I can't see what I'm doing. So I'll be right back, but stay tuned. Okay, so a little update. About 20 minutes later, I finished putting everything on my hair. It got a little messy. I don't know why I didn't think it would stain everything. It's probably because the bleach didn't stain like my neck or my clothes. Look at my neck right now. I need a shower. It's not going to come out. And the gloves had holes in it. And so my finger stained. Look at that. Please don't judge my nails. But my finger is stained now. I actually think I should wipe my neck down with this towel. 
so it doesn't stain. Scared to see how bad it is in the back. But here's my hair right now. I put it up in a bun to just keep the colors soaking. Is my neck is my neck okay? I feel like it's super dark back there. I'm like everything is stained. I don't know why I didn't think this would be so messy. Look at my shirt. It's all stained. Oh my god, I forgot to put I forgot to put a timer on. I just set the timer. I'm gonna probably just clean up the bathroom, look like a murder scene because I was spilling dye everywhere. Yeah, I'm gonna go get rid of all these stains and then shower after 25 minutes and let you know how it went. Okay, I'm back. I took a shower, washed my hair. A lot of purple dye came out and I got scared my bathtub was gonna get stained, but we're good. Um, but so far it looks like my hair just turned back to brown. So the two times I bleached my hair uh, Went to waste. I'm gonna go blow dry my hair and see like if the color is any different if my hair is drier Maybe it just looks darker because it's wet right now Oof. That was hot Okay, I'm back Turn on my camera and hello, hello. Okay, I just finished drying my hair kind of. I just didn't have the patience to completely dry my hair, but you get the point. So here is the final result of me trying to dye my hair silver. Still trying to get over the fact that I bleached my hair twice only for it to go dark again. The bleached hair lasted like what two weeks. But two, it's not completely back to my natural dark brown color. It has like a strange tone to it. Can you see that? So okay, in the camera I feel like it looks brown. Like you can still see the bleached brown but at some angles it has like a shimmer like silver e but almost green color let me see if i can take y'all directly in front of the light to see if you can spot the color okay i guess it just looks browner in front of the light hmm i don't know can you kind of see like that strange green silver color here you can still see my harsh line right there from when I bleached it but yeah you just like it kind of has a strange brown color now also is my neck still purple here I guess I'll see when I edit this video but I tried scrubbing it off glasses on it looks like an ashy brown now I think this was my spontaneous hair dyeing night vlog I hope you guys enjoyed this super sporadic, spontaneous video. I had a lot of fun doing it. I'm hungry now. That was a lot of work. <laughs> but that's it for this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. I am gonna go sleep now. <laughs> and I hope you enjoyed these super cheap prints that I bought to just like decorate this white wall. The edges are lifting because it's meant to be framed, but I cannot hang a frame on this. It's okay. I'll just need it. <laughs> I can still smell the the chemicals in my nose. Ooh. But anyways, okay, that's it. Thank you for watching. I'll see you in my next one. <laughs> okay. Bye.